Hey guys, Greg Silverman again, CIOs. Uh, didn't I tell you that it was a beautiful spring day and I'm living in this uh, veritable wild go garden of flowers, absolutely gorgeous, so loving it. Um, let's talk a bit about the VIX. The VIX is up at 63.64. That's way, way, way too high. Uh, it was up at, at about 15 before this crisis started. So the VIX has really taken over. A uh, lot of volatility in the market, a lot of choppiness. It, again, it's just not going to settle down. It needs a, it's a process. And so the VIX could stay elevated or bounce around for some time. So not an investor's market, guys. It's a trader's market. Uh, and if you're a fast trader, that's fine. Uh, if you're not, stay away. Uh, wait for this thing. And wh what's going to happen is, and I've already seen it happen, is this buy on the dip mentality. If we're in a true bear market, you should not be buying on the dips. Um, and that's still of a bullish mentality. And I think that's going to get uh, ironed out uh, t in a nice way. Just saying it and pu putting it politely um, before people will uh, capitulate into this market. Um, Listen, back in the 2008 to 2010 global financial recession, even subsequent to that, quality jobs never really came back as they should have and higher wage uh, jobs didn't come back and certainly wages never recovered. You'll remember uh, those, those months of very low wage growth. That has made the middle and lower class much more susceptible now uh, to this weakness. And of course, um, any bailout is going to go a lot to asset holders. And as a result, the wealth disparity in this country is just unfortunately going to become wider and wider. Um, that said, this hyperinflation, which may, uh, you know, I'm just throwing it out there, printing too much money is going to cause a rise in prices. And I would not be surprised to see uh, at some point the stock market, bonds, gold, everything reinflating and making new highs. Believe the unbelievable.